Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Kia. This is Curls with Kia. And in this video, I will be trimming my own hair for the first time ever. So I have dusted my hair in the past and I have done some practices that I'm not necessarily proud about. Like for example, like twisting my hair and then cutting the ends off. I'm pretty sure my hair was uneven, but my stylist just fixed it, so whatever. Just like hair vlogs that I post, I'm just documenting my journey and I'm hoping to inspire other people to embrace their natural hair. It's very obvious that I need a trim. The last time I had a professional trim was probably six months. It's been six months since I had a professional trim. It is a new year and I am getting out of my hair laziness. Let me give y'all an update on my hair. If you've been following me for a while, you know that my routines have been evolving. They've been changing constantly. I've been adding this, taking this out, but now I feel like I'm in a good place and I'm just so thankful. I'm so happy for that. And I guess we should just talk about the things that I no longer do. So let's do that. Come to find out, I needed to wash my hair more frequently and I now do that. And my hair is now more hydrated, <laughs> right? That's the term that we like to use. Wash your hair more frequently. And especially if you're using heavy butters and you are using oils and all kinds of products that you layer on, you need to get that off of your hair follicle. You just do. You just do. Not proud of it, but I didn't know any better, so that's what I did. But now, we're washing our hair more frequently. Yay. So that's that. I'll have to make a more formal video on some of the things I stopped doing, some of the things I started doing. I did not plan for this video to be that. I'm just supposed to be trimming my hair and giving y'all an update. But um, as far as life, life is going well. Married life is going well. Um, I need to work out more. Other than that, everything else is going well. <laughs> everything else is going well and I feel very blessed. I'm very thankful. I know that I have God's favor and I feel extremely fortunate and I thank God every day every single day every single day my jobs plural this has been actually i've always had two jobs for a very very long time and i'm tired i'm tired i want to i don't want to say soft life because i feel like that's a scam but i want to focus on doing more regular things like cleaning on Sunday or logging out after work or you know just having a downtime having a chance to read a book <laughs> like just regular things so I will be leaning into doing that more this year let's get into trimming this hair and again I am not a professional by any sense this is for entertainment purposes only and it's for you to laugh at somebody trying to cut their hair for the first time <laughs> because I will be laughing at myself. If you are a natural person and you have not trimmed or blown your hair out for a while, you should consider doing that. I am seeing a trend online of people saying that they don't trim their hair and I love my other naturals. I really do. And if that's their ministry, that's for them to do. However, here on this channel, we're going to trim our hair. Now, the reason you need to trim your hair is because if you have any kind of split ends, that split will just travel up your hair shaft and you don't want that to happen. And especially for people who have single strand knots. Single strand knots is a hair condition. It is not just, oh, you know, we have curly hair. It tangles all the time. Tangles and matting is, is something that our hair just does. That is a lie. It is a lie. I don't know who told us that, but we need to get over that. We need to trim our hair. We have to trim our hair and you will be seeing me trim my hair. Here's the hair. I am loving my hair. 
so much. I'm loving my hair and I'm excited to blow my hair out more. I did use the pattern blow dryer and I'm thankful. I'm thankful to have that blow dryer to use. Here's the hair update. Here's the hair update. And you can see where I need a trim. People who know hair, you can, you can see right here. So that's what I am going to be trimming off. The first thing I did was take my Denman D90 brush and brush my hair all around in the front, in the back, in the side, just to get my hair the same length <laughs> around. Clearly, I didn't know what I was doing, but you know, I applaud myself and I'm gonna go ahead and give myself an A for effort. Knowing that I had a lot of hair, I knew that sections were absolutely necessary. So that's me going through getting my sections together, together. And then after doing that, I sectioned my hair even more. And then we went ahead, used our satin scrunchies from Floor and Curl. Thank you, Floor and Curl. And now I'm just smoothing my hair out. Just smoothing it out and mentally preparing myself to cut these ends off. I noticed I had single strand knots. You can clearly tell when it's time for a trim in. I could not wait any longer. Y'all know I'm a little obsessed with my hair, so the ends had to go. So I'm pretty sure this was more of like a major dusting, but again, yeah. So make sure that you have shears. Use some sharp hair cutting shears. If you don't, <laughs> gather anything from this video and if you want to trim your hair at home please use the correct tool blow your hair out as straight as you can and you know brush it out comb it out hope pray and also schedule a stylist appointment <laughs> immediately after this <laughs>